So we have air pressure, right? Air pressure all around. Is there anyone in here, is there anyone in here who thinks that they could blow up this balloon while it's in this bottle? No way. Nobody? You could. All right. So here's the balloon. You just blow into it real hard until it blows up. Blow it up, try to fill the whole No, no, no. Just a balloon. <laughs> Anyone can do it with this one? Oh, I know. I know. You can do it? Alright. Cheers. Come here. So everyone can see. I know. This big old round. Oh, yeah. I know why it's going on. You can. Can you blow it up? So what happened when I blew it up? Maybe. Why was it easy to blow up? Why, what was this glass bottle? Why was it impossible to blow that up? Because there's air inside the bottle, right? Has anyone ever taken a bottle and tried to blow it up just by blowing on it? Yeah. Can you do it? No. Why? What's in the bottle? Air. And the bottle's strong. It's rigid. So the balloon, when you blow into the balloon, it's pressing against the air, and you can't blow into the bottle because all the air is in there. What was different about this? There's a hole in the bottom. So when I blew it up, what happened to the air that was in the bottom? It got pushed out. So all the air came out. So what, what, why isn't the air coming out of this? It took the shape. Did it take the shape? Well, it filled it up. Why? Why? Why doesn't the Why doesn't the air come out of this? Yeah. And the air's coming out the back, right? Right? Alright. <laughs> Here's my pen. Uh, people say the air doesn't come out. There's a nut in. There's a nut out. Things going in and out, right? Yeah. Nothing's trapped in there. Right? The air is not trapped inside the balloon. Watch. The air goes in. The air comes out, right? In and out. How does it do? Mr. Cole, why isn't the air in the balloon collapsing? Why is it stuck in there like that? All right. When we had a balloon on here, when we had a balloon on here, whoop, the cork's off. Did you see that? What happened to the balloon? What is going on here, right? All right. Now I put this balloon in, in here, and you said I couldn't blow up the balloon. Here's one right here. I can't blow this up. Why? Because the air is trapped in here, and I can't put more air in there. And it just can't. Well, I can't with my lungs. I, I'm not strong enough. Can somebody can? So what happened here? The balloon. I pushed all the air out. Right? Yeah. There you go. When I pushed all the air out, air pressure is all around us. We really don't feel it, but obviously there's a lot of air pressure around us. And we don't, we don't notice it so much. When I sucked all the air out, this time especially what I did was the balloon pressed up against the glass. So now there's no air. There's no air in the bottle. I mean, there's a little bit of air here. But I pushed all the air out of the bottle. So the air is outside, it's outside, it's outside, it's outside, it's outside. So the air pressure is equal on both sides of this hole here. Now, even though the cork came out, what the big difference here is, is the air pressure in the balloon goes out in all directions, right? 
is over this whole surface area here, right? Uh -huh. But the air pressure on this side is only on how much space? Because I took all the air out. That little. So where is there more air pressure, inside or out? Outside. Inside. Inside, there's more air pressure than there's outside. So it stays in its shape. Now, what if I let, if I push this so that the air can get in? What do you think will happen? Rizella? If you poke it? Yeah. So it all it all came out.